Hey guys, so today we're gonna be making a very popular Mexican cocktail drink. Uh, it's called La Paloma. I know here in the States we kind of associate Mexico with margaritas, but La Paloma is actually their to-go drink. This is what they drink on a regular basis, and it's grapefruit, lime juice, and tequila. If you don't like tequila, you can definitely change it for a different spirit, but it's not gonna taste the same. But if you do try it, let me know. Alrighty, so let's get started. You're gonna need a glass, grapefruit, a lime, lime juice, just kind of like squeeze a couple of them. It's gonna be sea salt. Uh, if you don't have sea salt, that's fine. You can use regular salt, but I highly recommend you use this one just because it gives it a different taste to it. Like it just, uh, it completes the drink. Um, ice, grapefruit soda, I'm using squirt today, but just use the one you have at home. Um, tequila of your choice. I have hornitos and I have cazadores. So I'm gonna go for cazadores because this one's already open. Me personally, I like um, tequila reposado better than I like um, tequila blanco or anejo, but whatever you like, use that. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna grab your glass and then just kinda like put it on the on the lime juice and then after that you grab your salt and you do this and there you are it's gonna look something like that once you have your rim decorated what you do is you're gonna spray half a grape juice and it's a little bit hard it's not hard it's just I have no strength so it's gonna be half of it. Just try to get as much juice as you can. And half a lime. I'm gonna use this to stir it. You can also use a shaker if you have one. I don't have one, so I'm just <laughs> using a straw. We are gonna use one shot of tequila. There you are. I mean, you can put more if you want, but that's up to you. And then you kinda like shake it a little bit. You don't wanna do this with ice already in it because it's gonna water it down. You don't wanna do that. So once you stir it for a little bit, you can add your ice. So now we're gonna add the ice. There you are. And we're just gonna top it off with one of these and one of these. It might be a little bit too big. Hold on. <laughs> so I kinda cut it down a little bit and Put it like that. And then once you're done with that, you open your soda. And you have it like that. With this drink, it's always gonna be more pink towards the bottom, but you can definitely stir it a little bit. And there you are, that's how it should look. Very pretty, very like light pinkish color. Okay, so I'm just gonna try it just so you guys can see. Um, so cheers to y'all. Yeah. It's like fruity but citrusy. Um, you can also add tahine if you like, but it's so refreshing, like, oh, so good. It just, ah, like, mm, I could, like, you could drink this at, like, summer party, like, for summer parties, really, really fun. Mm. Well, it doesn't even have to be a summer party. You can just, whenever you want, it's just so good. And then you can just 
obviously adjust to taste um if you want to make in big amounts use a lime juice like the one that comes in bottles and then use the grapefruit that comes in like grapefruit juice that way you can just mm. Mm. it's such a refreshing taste like i don't even i don't even know oh, let me see it could give you margarita vibes maybe you, you've had it but hold on Mm. I don't, it's so refreshing like just try it anyways see you guys soon bye oh like and subscribe thank you <laughs> bye